Good afternoon and welcome to Perth Stadium. You join us for this big bash match between the Perth Scorchers and the Melbourne Stars. I'm Mike Atherton and next to me in the commentary position is Mel Jones, Ali Mitchell, Ian Healy and the dashing David Gower. Thanks, Mike. Always a pleasure to sit alongside you. I thought these conditions looked good for batting, but they've chosen to bowl first. The bowlers will have to be extremely accurate in this opening spell. Not a lot of room for error, that's for sure. Players look ready. The umpires are in position for the first ball. The bowlers will want to focus on their line and lengths and let the ball do the rest. That was a tremendous delivery. Fizzed through to the keeper. No more short balls this over. Yeah, yeah. A direct hit and this could be gone. Exquisitely done on the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive. Could have been worth more. That's right off the meat of the bat. Yep. Off the front foot, hit it with all the power and elegance of a batter right at the top of their game. Rainbird shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots, just need to tighten their areas now. Gotcha! Lovely timing. Will this one go to the fence? Got their head right in line with the ball, a beautiful strike there down the ground. That last ball isn't something you'd want to see a repeat of. You don't want to be giving easy runs away. Good bit of timing there. That went all the way up toward the grandstand for four, driven away nicely. The crowd are really getting quite raucous. It's going to be difficult to focus down in the middle with this amount of noise. Yeah, yeah. No! That's off the middle of the bat. In the end, a very simple shot. Let's the ball come onto the bat and cuts it away for four. This match is getting unbelievably exciting and the crowd have joined the party. It's pretty noisy in the ground. Yep. Great oh, shot. No. Placement exquisite. It was in the gap, pretty much all the way along the ground to the boundary rope. Off to a good start now. big opportunity. They'd worked hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get big runs on the board. Yep. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Inglis gets off the mark. Will you listen to the crowd? They are loving it. It's difficult to hear yourself think in here. Oh, oh, yes. That looked nasty. Big shout. Wait on. Good catch. Yeah. Out. First wicket is down, back to the pavilion, and disappointment is etched on their face. Can't believe they got out like that.
Good return, back from the deep. And with that, they're off the mark. Times it nicely. That really wasn't a great delivery. Seen early and it was dispatched with aplomb. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key. Yep. No pressure as they found a gap. Still needed to be put away, short, in the zone, dealt with in some style. Rainbird from the south end. Catch him! Lovely shot. Good seam position, but overpitched and got what it deserved. That showed great skill and lovely timing. The boundary was the only place it was heading. Just need to keep it simple. Line and length, around about off stump, and that'll force the mistake. Wow, that's missed a lot. Yeah. Massive chance. Got hit to the boundary last ball and comes back with a dot. Well, that's a bit harsh, perhaps. I felt that it wasn't that wide. Yep, yep. Huge edge. Baller. There'll be one run here for them. Good running. Just finding the gap, and that allows for rotation of the strike and keeping pressure on the bowlers. This is everything. That's a wild one. Nothing elegant about that shot. Just not timing it at all. Poor play. Ooh. Beaten on the drive. Oh, nice one. Not a great shot in the end. Practices the shot again. Just need to keep their head down now. Great shot through the gap. It was just a little bit wide, well picked up, and let the ball do all the work, really, to push it down towards third man. Over ends, so too does the power play. Change is coming in the field. Well, for a brief moment, you thought there might be a bit of strife there. In the end, a good decision not to take on the field. Oh, that's hit them. And at pace, look painful. Well, they lose the second wicket. It's a long way back to the sheds. And you can tell they're not happy with that dismissal. A new batter always likes to feel bat on ball early on as they bring a bit of energy to the crease. Yep. Saw that early. No one's catching that. Great shot. You can't fault that shot. Nicely played and it was four runs all the way. They shouldn't get too discouraged with that last ball. The first step as a bowler is to get the batter playing, which they've managed. If they can find the right spot, the yes. reward will eventually come. Tucked it nicely into the gap. Pick up a single, rotate the strike. Can't get that outside the ring field. 
Good running, it needed to be as well, probably closer than they expected. Yep. Finds the fielder with that shot. Good running, just finding the gap, and that allows for rotation of the strike and keeps the pressure on the bowlers. The Scorchers weren't given much of an opportunity, a very tidy over. Yes. Great shot, great timing. A couple on offer here. Really race between the wickets after... Going with spin now. Kais Ahmad, the new bowler, into the attack for the Melbourne Stars. Yeah! Oh my, that's racing away. You can't fault the bowling. Sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there was absolutely no point in chasing that. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have been really happy with that last shot. Nice shot. That ball has been hit. It's flown into the crowd. To get that much power coming forward on the front foot is ridiculous. Yep, yep. It's a good shot. Four straight down the ground. There was minimal follow through, just great timing to punch it through the field for four. It's really hard not to get caught up in the excitement. The crowd are loving every minute of this game. Yeah, yeah. Onto the front foot, super shot, should be four. That's the 50 partnership between these two, gaining some momentum nicely for the team. Clip neatly off the pads, should get four. The fielder could only pick that up off the boundary rope. Punch that away through the covers with exquisite timing. Yeah. End of the over, and what a beauty it was. Say what you want about the bowling, but you've still got to hit them. Majestic batting. Coulter Nile, the pace bowler, coming into the attack. A bit of a mix-up, they'll need to improve their communication. Yes. Well taken, yes. had a lot of work to do and held on to a great catch. So that's the third wicket down. Not a happy person walking off the field. There's a real feeling of disappointment. Huge shot. That's a massive shot. Just incredible. Well, that was just textbook. Finds the space and power to lift that ball over the top. And it just keeps going. Tried for some... Stoinis, the right armour, is coming into the attack from the northern end. Nice shot, four runs. Solid partnership, 50 so far. Now it's time to really build a big score. You can see how good this pitch can be for batting. You want the player coming forward, but it's a tight margin. Only a touch full and put away. Drives and misses everything. A little late on that, no run scored. Strokes it languidly away to the fence. A lovely shot. Got it well enough to get it away to the boundary, a poor delivery and a fine shot in the end. Maxwell, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. 
Hit that hard. Nailed it. That's just silly. The power on that shot is incredible. That's the sort of shot you want to see at a cricket match. The last one helped the scoring rate, making their intentions clear. Couldn't get it through the field. A little flick of the wrist to get it round the corner for an easy run. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. End of the over. 18 runs coming from it. The Scorchers are three for 167. A real beauty. Just times it so well. Really good innings to bring up the half century. Impressive batting and they'll want to push on from here. That's a tough call for the bowler. I thought that was there to be hit. Yep. Yep. Doesn't beat the infield. That would have been a very risky single. In the end, a good decision to stay put. Yeah, mate. Quick to get onto that sweep. It was beautifully placed and beautifully struck for four. A boundary off the last ball. Is it a sign they're trying to push the run rate? Loud appeal. Yeah, mate. Nicely played, perfect timing. Found the gap with ease, wasn't the worst ball you'll see, but it's still raced to the rope. Playing all their shots in that over, a very expensive over. Going with pace now. Yep. No. It was a good comeback after that boundary last ball. The right armour is coming Marcus into the attack Sweden from the south end. Not a great shot to start the over. Another one gone, the fourth wicket is in the bag. A bit of trouble if there was another to fall quickly. We've seen some very good bowling. Coming to the wicket, they'll be looking to play within the V early and expand as they get settled. Stoyness with a superb delivery. Got. Ahmad, the spinner, coming into the attack. They make it home, but there should never have been the chance for a run out in the first place. Nice running between the wickets, clipping the pads, not the bat though. Yes! The whole team goes up for that one. They feel pretty confident about this. Needs to be on target. The keeper seems convinced this is out. Could be worthwhile sending it to the third umpire. Impact outside the line. 
Easy decision for the third umpire. Not the best decision to review that. The umpire has got it spot on. Yeah, mate. Really good shot there. Good return there, back from the deep. Wait. Fantastic yeah, catch. Yeah. Starting to get really interesting now. That's the fifth wicket and a very frustrated person is heading back to the pavilion. It was just a little bit too full, and it was beautifully timed. The end of another over. This time, though, some more fielding changes are coming as the restrictions are lifted. We thought it might be a good pitch to bat on at the start of the day, and we were right. It was a long, hard slog from the bowlers, and now it's a big total to chase down. A couple of big partnerships will be required to get these runs. Wait. Quick onto that in the infield. Yes. Just a little bit wide, well picked up. And let the ball do all the work really, just to nudge it down towards third. Just through the shot, too early. Yeah. Bowler. It was slightly shorter, but it was seen early. Got onto the back foot quickly. Just pushed it away behind square. Big edge. Yep. Super piece of timing. That ball was just an invitation that was accepted by return of post. Berendorf will be disappointed with that delivery. Beautifully played through the leg side off the back foot. This is where they can be so good because they were so quick to get back and onto this. End of the over, 10 off it. The stars are none for 10. The right arm medium bowler is coming into the attack from the northern end. Good shot, it's found the gap. It was a good comeback after that boundary last ball. The captain is going to change things around in the field. Exquisitely down on the front foot, a gorgeous looking drive. Could have been worth more. Yep. Picks the gap perfectly. Well, that was a really solid shot. Read the length early to get onto the front foot, and that raced away for four. Boundary off the last ball. What's to come off this delivery, I wonder? The captain making some adjustments to the field here. 
brilliant diving stop. Maybe they didn't pick it up. Very late on the shot. Yes. Did well just to get it down towards third for some runs. Decisive running might have gotten to. Uh, looking back at it, I'd say they'd have made it easily. So in the end, poor running. End of the over. Seven runs coming from it. The stars are none for 17. The captain's going to change things around in the field. No pressure as they've found a gap. Back and across, punched well off the back foot through points to get some runs. Oh, great bowling. That was a slower delivery. Played too early. And straight through to the keeper. A bit of a change up in the field now. Struck it nicely, could go to the boundary. Doesn't even wait to see if the ball's going to do anything. Onto the front foot, punches it away to the boundary. Stoinis has got the big shot away this over. Now they can focus on playing the next ball on its merits. Yep. That's great fielding, that ball was flying. Well, that was just a little bit wide. Well picked up, let the ball do all the work, really, to ease it down towards third. Yep, yep. There'll be one run here for them. Good running, just finding the gap, and that allows for rotation of the strike. Keep the pressure up on the bowlers. edge. End of the over. The stars are none. 28. And with that, five fielders can now be put outside the circle. Richardson from the northern end. Yeah. Huge edge. Marsh did very nicely out there on the boundary. No interest in that one from the batter. Richardson will be wanting to hone in on a better line and length to make them play next time. A bit lucky, that's just sailed through to the keeper. Does very well to get quickly across to that one. Good piece of fielding to stop some runs. Yes. Middle that one, great timing. You don't chase those down, brilliantly timed off the back foot and that's race to the boundary. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball, but you just gotta stay positive and believe the wicket will come. Got all of it, and for six. That was the slow ball, and it didn't fool anyone. Got the timing just right, beautiful shot. The 
just need to keep it simple. Line and length, around about off stump, and that'll force the mistake. That ends the power play. The captain with a bit more freedom in the field now. A few moves made in the field. Right on. Ball up. Can't get that outside the ring field. Yes. Good running, just finding the gap, and that allows for rotation of the strike and keeps the pressure on the bowlers. Well played. Capitalised on the loose delivery on the leg side. That was clever. Just had to wait on it to make sure of it. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have been really happy with that last shot. Bit of a change up in the field now. Yes. Misjudged that throw, and the batter survived what would have been a certain run out. Wait. Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Seven runs added in that over. The stars are on the. Agar has the ball in hand. The captain will be hoping they can tie down one end. Runs have been flowing a little too easily. Yep. That's what you pay the entrance money for. It's flown into the crowd. A brilliant shot off the front foot. No need to move. Yep. Thick edge. Tucked it nicely into the gap. Pick up a single, rotate the strike. Some adjustments to the field. Yes. That's right out of the middle of the bat. This match is getting unbelievably exciting and the crowd have joined the party. It's pretty noisy in the ground. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely just too early on the shot, couldn't find a gap. Immaculate timing there. That is an amazing half century, just mammoth stroke making. Such an impressive stint at the crease so far. A new ball. Monroe. Oh, to bowl the first over of the power play. It's going to be very tough to stop these two free-flowing batters. This will be the first over of the power play. This pair should be really trying to push the scoring rate along. Huge shot, that's yes. a massive shot, just incredible.
Top-class innings, been playing very nicely out there, and that brings up the half-century. Lovely yeah. timing. Will this one go to the fence? Just perfection, a majestic shot. You just... Cannot hit it any better than that. Raced away to the boundary. Obviously didn't like the look of that one, and just ignored it. Will you listen to the crowd? They are loving it. It's difficult to hear yourself think in here. Well left. There are two kinds of leaves in cricket. This is a good one, which sees the ball sail through to the keeper, and not one that's going to rattle the stumps. Yeah. Too good. Not sure anyone is going to cut that off. Pulled in off the boundary rope. Good fielding out there. A couple on offer here. Yes. Very sweet off the bat and four all the way. And that brings up I'd like to see them aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. A bit of shape on the ball as they let it go through. Tailed just a little at the end as it went through to the keeper. Yeah. Good bit of timing there. Fine placement and enough timing to get that ball away to the boundary. Hit right on the body. Misjudged it a bit, maybe. Couldn't seem to get out of the way. That will have hurt. A little late on that, no run scored. Tie to bowl the final over. They'll need a good one. Not much margin for error. A lovely drive square. Got forward well and was able to drive the ball. A lovely shot and good running. Scores now level, just one run needed. Only a batting meltdown could stop victory now. Yep. Not the ideal way of handling that ball. A great win, extremely close right to the end, and to bring the win home like that is something special.